What's going on, you guys? Andrew Roboto here, and welcome back to Five Nights of Warriors 3, where we will be taking on Night 3 in this video. So, without further ado, we will start Night 3 in the staircase. And for whatever reason, if I cannot beat Night 3 in the staircase, then I will do Night 3 in the second bedroom. So, yeah, so without further ado, we will take on Night 3 in the staircase. Um, I thought about calling you a little bit earlier, but you see, I got caught up in this news report. The police are looking for a man who has gone missing, possibly a criminal. His name was Richard... Richard McCloy is his name. ...something or other, I think. Pretty weird, because they interviewed some of his friends, and, you know, they all described him as a pretty friendly guy. Anyway, never mind. So, you're standing at the top of the stairs. Yes, I am. Well, that's both good and bad at the same time. You're standing in the dark corner, right? Uh -huh. Okay. Anyone who comes in from the second floor should only be able to see your face, or more precisely, your eyes. So, if you see a shadow from the door light on the floor there, quickly cover your eyes with your hands. Though the longer you cover your eyes, the longer it takes for your eyes to get used to the dark again. Keep that in mind. But then there's the first they can see you more clearly from there. You must watch the cameras to see if anyone is coming for you. The room closest to the stairs in the first floor is the, um, the, the, the old living room, I think. So, if you see someone in the living room, keep watching them on the camera for as long as you can. They will know that you're watching, and they should eventually go away. So remember, if you see someone in that room, stare at them through the camera, because if you don't look at them long enough, they will probably rush through the door, up the stairs, and... And you will die. Do something to you. And go there. Good. Okay, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll talk to you later. Okay, so I have actually played this night before on the stair, but I never beat it. Same with the second bedroom. So for this night, um, uh, we are dealing with Wario and Ashley, and for Wario, we have to listen for his sound cues and check on the living room camera and if we see him we have to stare at him long enough on the camera and for Ashley if we see her shadow on the top stairs then we have to cover our eyes in order for her to go away okay so for Wario I just gotta listen for his sound cues and see if I can track him on the camera cause if he's on the camera I have to stare at him long enough to make him go away cause if I don't then well he'll kill me And Wario will come rushing up the stairs if you do not check on him. Okay, I see Ashley's shadow, so I gotta cover my face. Okay, just gotta watch the living room camera. Recharge. And then rinse and repeat. Oh, I see Ashley. I gotta cover my eyes. Put the camera up because Wario could be coming in the living room. Wario could. Oh, okay. Okay, so I'm going to do night two, three in the living room, uh, second bedroom because this night is clunky to deal with. This, this is a clunky night. So without further ado, we will do night three in the second bedroom because the staircase is spoop is too spoopy for us to do, just like the kitchen. Alright, the second bedroom, I've done it before. 
What? Why is it playing Silent? Why is this game, The Night, playing Silent Night? It's not even Christmas, silly. Hello, hello. Hi, hi, this is Max. I'm, I'm just checking to see how you're doing. So, how did it go last night? You didn't feel sick or anything after you... Oh, I did feel <laughs> sick from taking all those pills. Huh? Did you take the very strong medicine? Yes, I did. Oh, boy. Well, um... I was the one who told you to do so. Yes, you did. So, um, the thing is, the side effects from those strong medicines don't come straight away. This means you might experience them tonight. Uh, the most common side effect is hallucination. You might think you see a normally friendly face that you've seen before, but since you're currently in this frightening situation, you might see it as something truly evil. Oh, you yes, I will. On the camera, quickly switch to another camera or pull it down. If you see a hallucination in your office, though, you should then pull your pad up again. You just want to look away quickly before your mind tricks you completely. Now, in this bedroom, you have a neat tool. This is probably where the parents slept, and they wanted to control the whole house. Do you see the cable on the ground that leads into the wall? Yes, I do. Have you plugged it into your pad? Good. Uh-huh. Now you can make static noises play in the room you're looking at by simply touching your pad. If you see some familiar ghosts, try tapping the screen many times. Hopefully the noise will scare them away because you don't really have anything else to protect yourself within there. Of course. Okay. Good night. And sleep. Okay, so for this night we're going to be dealing with um, Donkey Kong and Wario, which for Wario, if we see him on the camera, we have to, we have to tap the camera as much as we can. Like, see, there's Wario right there. We just have to tap the camera as much as we can, or else he will kill you. And then for Donkey Kong, we have to either switch cameras or put the camera up, because he's a hallucination. And then I just have to put the camera down from time to time in order to allow it to charge. Okay, I hear, this, I hear Wario moving. Okay, good. I thought I was screwed. Oh, God. Donkey Kong's here. Okay, good. Okay, good. I put the camera up in time to avoid his jump scare. Good. And now I gotta recharge the camera and then rinse and repeat by, by tapping the camera to make static noise to make Warrior go away. I have done this night before, but I just never beat it. Like, I couldn't beat the stairway or the second bedroom. Okay, so for Wario, we just have to keep pressing the camera to make him go away. Okay, I, I saw Donkey Kong. I just switched cameras. Okay, there's Wario. Okay, good. Put the camera down to charge it. Put it back up. And rinse and repeat. Oh, Donkey Kong, put the camera up. Alright, good. That got rid of him. Great. Because I don't want to get jump scared by him because he's a hallucination. Okay, I switched cameras. Good. Oh, there's Donkey Kong. Put the camera up. Okay, good. I should go with the camera recharge for a bit. Okay. That! Ah! Okay, I see where are you in the hallway. And now I gotta put the camera down so I can let it recharge. I mean, I I don't have much time to charge up the camera because I need to be focused. Because I have to be focused on Wario and Donkey Kong. Up, oh, Donkey Kong's here. Put the camera up. Good, got rid of them. Great. Cause I played this night before in the original game, but I just never beat it. And Donkey Kong makes like gorilla sounds whenever you. He jump scares you. Okay, good. I'm keeping Wario at base, so that's good. Okay, recharge the camera for a bit and put it back up. Okay. So I know how to deal with Wario and Donkey Kong. Got a strategy down. And then Wario, Wario will only appear on. Uh, let me think. 
Wario is only going to appear on cams 2, 5, and 6. Okay, I got to let the camera recharge. The more, the more you press, the more you make the static noise, the more Wario will stay on those cameras. So you're going to want to do that in order to avoid getting killed by him. And I just saw Donkey Kong. And I just had to switch cameras. Okay, there's Donkey Kong. Put the camera up. Okay, got rid of him. Great. Oh, I got a... Oh, God, Donkey Kong's here. See, I get rid of him? Good, okay. And now I gotta get rid of Wario. Or stop Wario from coming to get me. Okay. 5 a.m., it's... it's Alright, it's 5 a.m., we're doing well so far. Good. Okay, let's hope we can beat... Let's hope we can beat... Let's hope we can survive in the second bedroom on the first try. Okay. Okay, good. You're staying on that camera? Great. This whole camera static thing reminds me of Tubby Lamb Return when I had to deal with Tinky Winky. Alright, we beat night three. Alright. Alright, so we survived in the second bedroom with no trouble at all. Because the last two bedrooms I died in. But we survived in the second bedroom with no trouble at all. I died in the stairway, though. Okay, so anyways, we will take on night four in the laundry room in the next video since, of course, I want to do laundry in this video game like I do in reality. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button. Also, comment and subscribe. I appreciate the support you've given me, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.